Hi guys, it's Michelle. Today I'm going to be showing you how I have decorated my front entryway for fall. And I am collaborating with one of my YouTube sisters today. She's also going to be showing you her front entryway. And she is for Lisa with Home Body Work for Lisa. Look at her beautiful home, you guys. Go over as soon as you finish watching this video and check out for Lisa's video. It will be listed in the description box. Her home is beautiful inside and out. So definitely check her out. Okay, so I'm going to be starting off with this beautiful mercury glass uh, vase. It actually comes with a top. It's actually a huge apothecary jar. And I put some of these uh, beautiful neutral colored um, flowers in it from Hobby Lobby. And this is the smaller version of it. I absolutely love these. And uh, I'm gonna put those to the left because I have this small chest here and I'm gonna balance things out around the mirror that I have, okay? So I'm gonna go in with this um, huge candle here. It is a battery operated candle. And I just wrapped some sequins around the bottom because I'm using black as my accent color. Even though black is a neutral as well, it is gonna be my accent. This beautiful candle holder right here is from Home Goods. I'm going to incorporate these wooden beads that I got from Kirkland's. I got these from Kirkland's like a year ago. Um, and I'm just gonna wrap them around the base of the candle holder. And that's gonna help to tone down, uh, you know, the silver a little bit and also incorporate more black. This is a beautiful Ming box that I got from Home Goods as well. And it's a much, it's a much better price at Home Goods than what you would find at Z Gallery. Now I still have a little bit of space above my box, so I'm gonna incorporate my bling pumpkin that I got from Ross. I think I got this from Ross like two years ago, but they do have it again this year. I've seen it in there. So right now I still, I have filled the space between the bottom of the mirror and the things that are on the table. So that's kind of what I'm going for when I style a table like this. Uh, just make sure to fill in the spaces where it doesn't look like, oh, something else should go there. Uh, so I like the way this looks and I'm gonna put one more thing, which is my bachelor pad candle, which also incorporates the black and it smells amazing. It smells like the polo men's cologne. It smells so good. So I'm loving the way this looks and I was going for silver, black and cream and that's exactly what I pulled off. You know guys, I was talking to my daughter the other day and she was telling me that she, she sees beautiful things in the store, but she gets anxiety because she doesn't know what she's gonna do with it when she gets home and she doesn't wanna waste her money. So my question to you is, do you ever have that issue where you see something awesome in the store that you're really drawn to, but you don't know what to do with it? Let me know in the comments if that happens to you but go ahead and hit the subscribe button because I'm gonna be showing you different ways to style all types of decor. In fact, I'm gonna be decorating my daughter's apartment. She is moving into her apartment tomorrow and I'm gonna do an empty apartment tour first and then I'm gonna show you how it's decorated after I get done with it. So stay tuned for that. Definitely subscribe so you don't miss out on that. And don't forget to go and check out for Lisa. Let her know that I sent you over there to her. She does beautiful styling, you guys. Here's another look at the front door. I did put some wallpaper against the wall with the door and the windows. And um, over to the left, this is a new item right here. I. This is originally, this nine piece candle holder is originally from Kirkland's, but I actually bought this from a Facebook, a Facebook marketplace seller and it was for an amazing price. And over here has not changed. I still have my two vases and the big mirror, which I do plan on painting this mirror. And I might use my 
um, metallic paint on that, but I'm not sure yet. So I'm still deciding. <laughs> so guys, I want to thank you all for watching. Go ahead and check me out on Instagram because I am posting a lot more over there. And I have some pictures at the end of this video and I will see you in the next one.